let's take a look at two really neat features in your plan builder. So the first one is creating a header. So if we look at a task row and we click on the three vertical dots and click create heading. So a heading is really helpful because it helps organize your plan. So let's say, for example, you are building a workout. Any good workout has a, a warm up section, right? Uh, and then you can add in your, your tasks that you want to do, and then you can create a brand new header for the main workout. And then, of course, every good workout also has a cool down, right? So if we add in a task for each section, right, and we go to view as client, right, we'll see warm up main workout, and then cool down. So this is just really nice to help keep your plan more organized. And then another thing that you can do, let's actually add it here. So if we wanted to, to create a super set with a task, so we have hooray squats here. If we click the three vertical dots, create super set. And then what you'll see is this purple band around it. And then if we click the plus button, we can add another task. So let's add this here. So now this is a super set. You could also use this to build circuits as well. So you could add in as many tasks as you want. Uh, something else that you can do as well is click and drag up into the super set as well. So if we go to view as client, right, we'll see that this here under warm up, these are the tasks that are grouped together. So you'll see this big white box and then the individual tasks within it. And you'll see all of the names up here as well. All right. And then that is adding supersets and headers.